it was about 28 k's, I think, this particular day. 28 k's. Yeah. And I was just just about... A 200 pound pack and a rifle. I'm now on top of a massive feature and I'm looking down and the guy who set off just before me, I'd overtaken him. Um, he was, again, a fa one of the faster runners. We'd overtaken everybody else. We'd already gone in front of everybody. Did he and, pass? Yeah, he did. So he's, he's I'm, I'm coming down towards his checkpoint and I, I can see the four turn on the road. I thought, right, that's, that's the trick the map, yeah, that's it's definitely the checkpoint, yeah. So I, I don't know if that's the last one because you never tell you how far you're going. Then you just get given the next grid. I know, this was the painful thing for me. That's the thing about what makes you different, yeah. isn't it? It's because you never know where it's going to exactly. end. You don't. You're not told how long the march is. So you've or got to have a going. mindset that there is no end to this hell. Keep going, keep basically. going. Yeah, yeah. Go that bit further. Again. So I'm looking down, and I can see the checkpoint. It's only it's about 800 meters, 900 meters away off the mountain. And at the time, the guy who was behind me just comes up level with me, and then carries on. And as I, as I go to walk off, 